When I first started, I would go on an assignment where I was the writer and there was a photographer with me and I would send, you know, come back to the office, write the information, and then someone else would go out and, and import it into a system where now if you're going out, you're taking the picture, you're writing the story, you're writing it on the road and entering it either on a laptop, um, you're doing the editing, you're blog, you have to take the 800 word story that you've written, 900 words, and you've had to already condense it into 400 for the online version that's going up immediately. You have to do so many things that I didn't have to do just because it didn't exist. I took a journalism class as a sophomore year out of just curiosity and I kind of fell in love with it. You get to create something. I mean, you get to create something and one day people are going to be able to look on that wall and say, hey, that guy wrote that. And one day you're going to be in that position where you're going to walk into a place and you're going to say, that's mine. And everyone's going to know that you created that. And that lasts forever. I feel like every year I learn more about the business because the students keep me young. The students keep me active. A degree is wonderful, but what did you do with that degree while you were here? Do you have clips? Do you have reels? Do you have any audio work? Do you have your own blog? Be creative. Between Instagram and Twitter, people writing these small little essays, you have to make your own luck here. You just have to be aggressive, creative, and, and willing to work.